So now that we have the entry view templates done for both news and drinks, and we have the home page done, there is also a listing page for the drinks and the news. And if you go to slash drinks, it's gonna show template not found because I haven't created it, but this would be an index template in drinks. And if I go to drinks slash index.html, you can see I get this listing of the drinks added to the menu on and the style. So go ahead and add the listing. You might have to add a new field for added to the menu on, do that. For the style, you can just leave that static for now. And this static template is in your templates that you downloaded. If we go to them, you can just go to drinks and index and it's right here. So you have everything that you need there and it's also in news index, same thing. And this is going to be a listing template. So it's going to be similar to what we did on the home page. If you remember on the home page, we just go to the home page template. We use the for loop to get all of the entries in news, limited it to 10 dot all, and then we outputted some information about them. Do the same thing, do a for loop, but instead of looping over this output on the home page, you want to loop over the output for this table. Again, not all these fields are created like the added to menu on. If it's not, go ahead and create it. But I want you to get the experience of taking a static template like this and modeling it in craft and then outputting it with the proper content and structure. So go ahead and do that and then we'll work on it together in the next video.